Oh my god. Also, I kind of like the look of Deep Slate. Is that weird? No, that's... I mean, it looks good, the brick. Yeah, I hate digging it, but it looks so nice. It's pretty good. And I don't think you need a... You don't need to smelt things to make bricks. Last time I checked. Last time you checked? Um, Last time I checked. Alright, fair enough. I never check anything. Except my credit score, and it doesn't exist. Oh. Hey, Bobby, what's your credit score look like? (laughs) Very average. Very average? Very average. Like, what what kind of average are we talking about? Average good or average bad? I'm pretty sure average is like 7... Twenty, pretty sure. That's that is like average. That's, okay, that's not average. That's good. That's good. When when someone says, "Oh, I have an average credit score," they're talking like maybe. Well, I don't have. I don't have like a credit card. Well, then how the I, fuck? I do have a credit card, but I don't have like big credit investments. You know, like big loans. I'm trying to. I pay think off. that's a good thing. It's a good thing, but you don't build like build your credit very. I'm genuinely so offended. Like yeah, you're over I here, yeah, 750. Not. My credit score doesn't even fucking exist. <laughs> well, uh, get get a credit card. I know, I really need to. But why do that when Bobby, hey, are you looking for a wife? For a wife? Yeah, are you looking for a wife? Gosh, I don't know. That's a that's a big commitment right there. Yeah? Yeah. You're not looking for a wife right now? Oh shit. Well there went plan B. <laughs> Because now I have to get a credit card. <laughs> you get a yeah, now I have to go get my own credit, credit score. Card. Damn it. That was my option number two. I was like, I'll just marry someone who has good credit. <laughs> marry somebody. Yeah, just marry someone for the tax write off. Oh, yeah. Hell I yeah. mean, like, okay, wait, like, hear me out. Not every rich man has a good personality, okay? And, like, don't get me wrong. Would I marry for money? Maybe. But that's not a very good idea, realistically speaking. Yeah, realistically So instead, speaking, I'll just marry for a really good credit score. <laughs> yeah, credit score and a mediocre personality at best. Yeah, exactly. Like, I need a mediocre personality that I at least won't want to shoot myself every day. Um, yes. And then a really good credit score, because, you know, you may not have the money now, but as long as you have the credit score, dude. It's only a matter of time. Exactly. Exactly. Like money comes and goes, but you want to know what stays? A credit score. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just letting you run with your artistic vision because. Did um, you just say. Uh, excuse me. Artistic you, vision. Okay. Okay. What did you think I said? I, I thought you said the other A word. I thought you're. Yeah, I'll just let you run with your artistic vision here. <laughs> excuse me. Uh. That would be even funnier, though. Your autistic vision. Yeah, my autistic vision here. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense why you were playing with blocks then, you know? Yeah, that does not... <laughs> Have you ever seen Eli Stone? <laughs> Eli Stone? No, I haven't. Yeah. You've never seen Eli Stone? No. Dude, it's so good. What? What is it about? Um, it's about this guy who, like, starts getting all these visions. Like, he's a lawyer, right? And he starts getting visions that start, like, coming true. And he's starting to help these people that are in his visions and or that are connected to them. So his acupuncturist friend thinks he's getting visions from God. And he thinks he's sick. So he goes to see his brother, who's a doctor, you know, because they're obviously good money. Anyway, he goes to see his brother who's a doctor, and his brother's like, oh my gosh, hey, little bro, guess what? You've got a brain aneurysm. A brain aneurysm? Yeah, so it's a brain aneurysm, and he's like, okay, bet, so that's why I'm getting all these weird visions. It's not God, it's literally me being sick, except all of them are, like, so true. I've only ever seen season one, and I really want to see season two, and I've got season two, I'm just afraid to watch it. Like, what if it's not as good as season one? Well, I guess you just have to find out if it's... Yeah, I could do that, or I can just live with season one being really good. You just have to try it. You know, so, kind of had the same thing with with, uh, One Punch Man, the second season, and uh, 
the animation was just not the same, but it was still okay. And I'm I'm Good glad job. I watched it. So maybe it's just going to be okay. Maybe it's a maybe it would just be a resolution to your curiosity. I mean, um, I hate to tell you this, but I uh, I didn't watch the second season well, of One Punch Man. Are you serious? Yes. Okay. Wait. No. To be fair, like, hear me out. Okay. Hear yeah. hear me out on this yeah, one. You're just I... that the you'll hurt, but no, I don't think I, I don't think I will. No, 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 no. This one, this one has good reasoning. Good reason. Okay, so hear me out. I watched the first season like maybe a year after it come out, and it took a little bit longer for season two to come out. And like, I'm a binge watcher. Okay. I watch it all at once. So, yeah. like, I found out that the second season was coming out, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's really dope. But, you know, it wasn't all out. So, I decided not to watch it yet. And then I kept putting it off, and now I still haven't watched it. That's terrible. Isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's terrible. great. Why you haven't watched it? Um, I also did the same thing with my favorite anime, except I finally watched season two for it. What's your favorite anime? You want to take a guess? I'll give you three. Three? Yeah, I'll give you three guesses. Also, go to sleep. Come here. Is it is it something I've heard of before? Um, Maybe. It might not be, though. I have no clue. Most people say, oh, I've heard of that, but I've never seen it. Uh, Hunter x Hunter. Everyone's seen that. Oh, my God. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, top five, maybe even top three, but not my favorite. Second guess. Come on, you have to move on and guess number two. I, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying. Yeah, this is you trying. Yeah. It's that autistic vision coming back. <laughs> All two of my brain cells are on overdrive right now. Damn, only two. Yeah, only two. I'll say relatable. Same. Actually, no. I think I have at least six. At least. How six. many brain cells are people supposed to have? At least two, I think. You know what? I feel like you're right. I don't think that makes sense. I don't know. I don't feel like it should be more than 12, though. People that just feels like a lot. Here. Yeah. 12 might be too much for some. Yeah. No, that just kind of feels like excessive. Like, why would you need all 12 of them? Like, you can't even count those on your fingers you anymore. You really don't. Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, you only have 10 fingers, and you're meaning to tell me it exceeds all of those? Nah. All ain't no way. Fingers, all your phalanges. Yeah, exactly. Nah. Are you the one I looked that up with? Did 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 you look that up with me? I don't know. I no, that was just. I was wondering was if your toes. I, I don't use. Okay, wait. No, hear me out. I wanted to know if your toes and your fingers were considered the same thing because hear me out. You know when people have like super like flexible toes. So they can bend them how they want. And like it's basically an extra hand. Like monkeys. And I was wondering if they had the same name. As like fingers. I was like what if they're just finger toes. But like the scientific name. And somebody was like aren't they just called fingers and toes. And I was like no. There's got to be a scientific name for it. Because there's a scientific name for everything. And I found out it's phalanges. And yes they are both called that. Because they both have the bones. That create what they are. Yes. I'm good with words. We're good with words. I mean, that jump was. I have no clue where this is going, but I'm here for it. This, this here, you know, yeah. it, it's a work in progress. Yeah, I believe. Honestly, I feel like a complex is already starting. It doesn't have to be symmetrical here. Yeah, it's turning into a prison. Yeah, wait, it really is? Or? <laughs> it, it's starting to look like one. I mean, we have just cobblestone and deep slate. We haven't, we haven't made any artistic moves here, or <laughs> any artistic diversity whatsoever. It's cobblestone, deep slate. Fuck this, <laughs> fucking house. Okay. But to be fair, we um we are in limited <laughs> options considering we're in the middle of the ocean. We are, we are working with very limited supplies here. I mean, we've got. An almost tree farm. Actually, let me go chop down more trees so we can Thank get you. more wood. Because that's smart. I could be helping right now. Oh, shoot. Do you still have an axe? I'm going to make an axe. I'm going to use, um, I'm gonna use iron. 
and make an axe. Is that a bad idea? No. I feel like it's a bad idea. But, like, I'm gonna do it anyway. Oh. Never mind, I have to chop down wood first. Got I got you, I got you an axe. I got you an axe. <gasps> you got me an axe? Oh my Dude. god. I don't even have to axe the qu- you're... You do this to spite me. I do. Thank you. <laughs> I'm really excited. Like, oh my gosh, you got me an axe. <laughs> oh, did I just hear it break? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it only did one. Gosh. I'm so offended.